College is the time for fun. It is also the time to learn and prepare yourself for the future. While there are a lot of skills required to do well in colleges, there are also many tools out there that help you accelerate your learning process. In the age of the internet, there is a tool for everything. So here is a list of websites that will help college students excel. All the websites are general so as to make sure that the list is useful regardless of the major. So without further ado, let's get into the list. I'm Lei, and you're watching The Curious Elephant. First up, learn anything. LearnAnything.xyz is a search interactive mind map to learn literally anything. All topics are connected by their relevance to one another. This makes the mind map super easy to understand. Let's take mathematics as an example. As you can see in the mind map, it is connected to physics, cryptography, computer science, engineering, and so on, all of which uses mathematics as their foundations. So let's say you have decided that you want to learn mathematics. All you need to do is to click on the button. Then you're taken to the sub mind map for mathematics, which contains various topics within the domain of mathematics. It always starts with the basics and then it branches into more in-depth topics like calculus and statistics. For every topic, it also has a tool section that links the tools you can use to accelerate your learning. This website is open source and it is contributed by people from all across the globe with their study notes and videos. This is why it is so awesome. Frankly, I can make an entire video about learnanything.xyz alone. It is a good place not only learn topics in depth, but also help you visualize the interconnectedness between topics. I highly recommend it for college students. Then it's canva.com. I have promised at the beginning of the video that all of the websites on the list will be useful for all majors. Canva.com is another great tool for college students. Nowadays, all college students need to have some designer skills so as he can make great presentations, promotional materials, and so on. Canva.com can be your one stop for that. It provides stunning PowerPoint designs, banner designs, YouTube thumbnail designs, and more for free. You can design your own slides too with the vast library of pictures and icons provided by Canva.com. Most of the designs on the platform come free of charge, but by paying a few bucks per month, you can get better options too. I have been using it to design all of my thumbnails on YouTube. It does more than a decent job for me. Thirdly, if Learn Anything still can't satisfy your thirst for knowledge, this website should do the job. It's called Stack Exchange. One tip I can give you is that when you go to this website, you should click on the All Sites tab on the top right. This will take you to a collection of websites that Stack Exchange uses to source its answers. Once you are there, you can go to dedicated websites for the topics of your interest. For example, if you want to ask questions mathematics related, you just click on the mathematics and click visit site. If you want to learn Japanese, you can scroll down and you will see a dedicated square for Japanese. Click visit site, it will take you there. Stack Exchange has a great selection of topics and cover almost anything. So definitely try it out. Now we go to Coursera. Founded in 2008, Coursera is the most successful course learning website in the world right now. As of February 2017, Coursera has more than 24 million registered users and more than 2,000 courses. Covering almost all topics, you get professors and courses from MIT, Stanford, University of Pennsylvania, and so on. Most incredible of all, many of the courses are free and you get a good selection of topics. But my suggestion is that you should at least take a look at those paid courses. They are worth it. For a few hundred bucks, it could be a good investment. Next, Uframe Alpha. It is a good engine for mathematical computation. For example, if you're interested in calculating the force of a spring, you can head to the physics section and click on the engine for the force of a spring. There you go. The rest of the work is just entering numbers from your questions. While many schools might argue that the students should do these competitional works themselves, I am against it. I think no matter how much you practice, you can't outwork a computer, and hence, you should take advantage of it. So check out Wolfram Alpha and start saving your time on the useless works. The last two on the list is unlike all I have mentioned. I want to recommend two websites that will improve your productivity. College is not always about learning, it's also about keeping healthy and happy. 
So the next two websites are designed for that. The first one is a workout planner for students. It's called Swerkit, S-W-O-R-K-I-T. It's a customizable workout planner that helps you to fit workouts into your lives. This is great for college students with different schedules. You also have the option to let the websites know what are your aims in workouts so that the workout designed will be designed to achieve that aim. Of course, this should be used together with bodybuilding.com, which is the best training website out there. Last but not least, I am going to recommend Spotify for college students. One thing about improving efficiency is to stay happy. There is really not a better way to stay happy than listening to the music you love. On top of that, Spotify helps you discover new music based on your listening history. Regardless of the activities you're doing, be it learning, practicing tests, or working out, a good piece of music is always the best companion there is. All right, that's it. Thanks for watching. Hope you like this one. Once again, I'm Lei. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.